Welcome to Media 7 TV. I'm your host, Matthew Weston, and it's concert time. Yes, it's the annual APC fundraiser, Gospel Explosion, brought to you by the people at Friends and Faith. Before we reveal the list of stunning artists that will be performing that evening, our very own entertainment correspondent, Jacqueline Smith, has an exclusive with one of the top performing artists, Jermaine Cowan. Hi everyone, it's Jacqueline from Media 7 TV, and I've got the exclusive with the brightest talent in gospel reggae music, Jermaine Cowan. How are you, Jermaine? What's up? I'm blessed, highly favored. What's up, everybody? It's your homegrown, your nephew, your cousin, Jermaine Cowan, right away. Jermaine, let's start by you telling us, how did you get into the music industry? Well, we can start from, um, say, back home. Um, here we say DJ, back home we say selector. You know what I mean? So I was a selector back home, um, came here, Still doing the music, so 98, 99. So what kind of inspiration or advice would you like to give an aspiring young artist? One of them, they have to be humble in this business, first and foremost, you know what I mean? Let's talk in. Let the music speak for itself. Second thing, they have to become a student in this business. And, um, you know, not just more the artistry, but more learn the back end of the business because um, for the past six, seven years, the music business gone down. Okay. And be humble, love people because a God deserve. So what does the future look like for Jermaine Cowan? Uh, I tell you, there's so much going on on the plate right now. I'm just finishing up some overseas traveling. You know, this year has been a really good year for me. And um, I'm putting together the, the second project, which is called Transparent. We just dropped around four singles this year. And um, we're dropping a new one called Moving On. And it's on fire. You trust me. <laughs> Oh yeah. So listen, Represent. just do me a little favor. Can you just give us a little taste of what we're going to expect uh, on October the 8th? You see, I know she was going to do that. I had to. But the song say, um, the new single that's going to drop, it said, moving on. It said, uh, not tomorrow shine your light today. That's why me shout right away. No more hurt and sickness. I know it's going to be a brighter day. From Sunday to Saturday. All I see, it's better days. Don't worry, don't fret no more. The father done bless me with many years. That's great. Right away. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. Guys, you have to go check him out on October the 8th. Do not miss it. They don't want to miss this an inch. If they blink, they miss it. Trust me. But you know what? They want to bring less, less heels, more flats. You know, because there's going to be a cat of one time. Bring all your towel, your kerchief, bring all the bed sheet, everything you can use to, to all the weave. All the weave on, wig, everything. Just bring them. We're going to have a cat of one plus time. Well, thanks for being with us. Anytime. Thanks everybody for watching. Back to Matthew. Thank you, Jackie. Along with Jermaine Cowan will also be Marie English Critchlow, Norwell Simmons, Dave Brown, Londa Larmon, Rhoda Lewin, One Voice, and a whole lot more. This annual event will be held at Forest Brook Community Church on October 8th at 7 p.m. sharp. Tickets will be $25 for adults and $10 for the kids. You don't want to miss it. You